see you. Well, I haven't seen you in some time. But now you look, you're like a leading man like to beat the band. Oh, uh, I don't know about that, but thank you. No, thank it's you. true. It's true. I'd be lying if I didn't very say good. that. Very good. Did you like that? I worked on it all night. Let me ask you about this film. It's interesting because you are playing an Australian, an adopted Australian who goes back to India. Yeah. And for yourself, as someone who's grown up in the UK, did you sort of tap into the experience of being a person from another culture and what that's like to be part of a global you know, diaspora? And, what, and this guy goes back to India. He has no real knowledge of, the, of where he comes from and the way that... I mean, I'm really lucky because, uh, you know, I, I have a really rich heritage that goes, my parents were born in Nairobi uh, in East Africa, but, you know, our family ancestors, used to, you know, were in India and I grew up in London with my sister. So I, you know, I have the privilege of having so many cultures that, you know, make up my identity. And, you know, I could really tap into that feeling of being a person that's torn between two worlds for the role. So it, it did help bringing an element of truth to the character. I mean, and in the second huge movie you've done with an Indian context, obviously. Yeah. Do you do you ever want to work just exclusively like and do a just a big broad American movie or a big broad British comedy? Or? I mean, I, I just relate to characters. I, I would I would hate to think that, you know, doing an Indian film is B grade. You know, I think. Uh, I wouldn't what, think so. Yeah, exactly. This is like triple A grade. So what I would say is that you know I'm interested in making films about humanity. You know, and the same way. De Niro can play in Italian. I, I want to embrace part of my heritage and bring that to an international screen. Do you feel now, I mean, from the first time you went through award season, your yeah. very first exposure to it, what's the difference like? It's, um, I mean, I'm a lot more aware of it now because, uh, you know, when I first came here, I was like 17 years old and I was wide-eyed and tripping over dresses and it was very awkward. Now um, I'm absorbing it a bit more, which is really cool. And you've got it down. You feel confident when you're out there? No, not at all. I mean, this is a terrifying place to be. I'm, I'm like a swan, kind of composed on the, on the surface but below my legs. Roiling, are. roiling underneath the skin. Yes, it's, it's horrifying. But I, it's not showing. This is acting then. Oh, yeah, it is. This is the biggest, biggest acting I've ever done on this carpet. Well, it's terrific. And it's a wonderful film. I Thank hope you. everybody goes and sees Lion. And uh, good luck with everything tonight. Thank you so much. Thank man. you. Have a good evening.